Yo, what is going on, y'all? I'm Cavell Anderson, and we are back with another VV and Ecomi video, and we have some huge, huge news, man. There's a huge tool that absolutely every single person who um, is invested in Ecomi, you all need this. Every single person needs it, and we're going to be going into that later in the video, but before we jump into that, we are going to be going over the charts. I'm going to be giving you all some of my price predictions as far as the short term and where I can, I think we can realistically go talking about soon here. So, um... Yeah, before we jump into that, be sure to drop that thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and turn on notifications so you stay updated. Also, look down below in the in the description so you can follow me on social media, as well as some other helpful links. So, jumping into it, as you can see, we are up 20% right now. We're moving, we're moving fast. A lot of people are happy, people are getting excited, and me personally, I think we're witnessing the calm before the storm. Now, what does that mean? I mean, there's like, I, I was just talking to another YouTuber about this. There, There's no doubt in my mind that, that Ecomi has the Pokemon license. Um, but at the same time, I don't know what makes more sense. Should they, should they release Pokemon, risk crashing and breaking the freaking app, but then once they fix all the problems that come from that, they don't have to worry about any other drop because the biggest haymaker that they could have dropped, it's, it's, it's done already. Or should they keep going up, up, up until they like, and kind of like slow and steady. And honestly, knowing them, they're probably going to take the slow and steady route anyway and lead up to the, like the, and scale it properly, you know, scale it slowly. I don't see them as a, bam, crash everything, build it up, and then like, I don't, I don't see them doing that on purpose. Now, the app did jump from 5,000 people that they expected to 250,000, but they did nothing. They, they could not, they could not have seen that coming. This would be something that they caused, and that just doesn't seem like their style to me. So I don't think that we are going to see a Pokemon release, but I do think we are witnessing the calm before the storm. I think we're going to break all-time high very, very soon, and it's going to be within this next announcement. I think this next announcement is going to be so big that not only are we going to break all-time high, I think we're going to get between 2 to $0.05 cents just from this next announcement. Um, and that that's my personal price prediction, and I know a lot of people don't, understand or don't think that Ecomi can move at certain speeds but I think a lot of people very very greatly underestimate the power of what Ecomi can do and they're also teasing doing like extra bonus burns and stuff like that they're teasing certain burns and, and extra bonuses on Twitter like that like I feel like the the um the developers and the the CEO I feel like the whole Ecomi team is just so down to earth and and in touch with all sides of this project that it's going to make everybody happy. Everybody is going to win with this project. They're going to win. The investors are going to win. And the people on the app, using the app day in and day out, are going to win. The experience is amazing. And then they know exactly what to say and what to do to get us investors excited. I feel like all around, they just have this industry and this, they have everything on lock right now. And um, yeah, that leads me to believe like this, this slow rising we're seeing right now, Listen, with this rise, I feel like we're, we're going to hit that point very, very soon where we will never be down here at certain lows again. And I feel like we are technically at a low right now. I wish that it would go back down, even though I don't foresee this going back down. Um, but yeah, I mean, listen, I feel like some huge, huge things is coming on right now. I feel like we're going to see something very, very big. But um, before we jump into that, before we get into like the big, big news that... Um, that I have for you all I do want to take a look at the burn data so as you can see today we have burned 1.5 million um 1.5 million Omi and there's still nothing substantial that's been done so as you all can see we have been averaging a million and up when it comes down to burns and there's really nothing new going on nothing new that changes and this is this is what leads me to believe we're gonna burn this way faster than people may realize because I wouldn't be surprised to start seeing, like, once they start releasing every feature and start releasing everything that there is to do. Like, you, if you saw my earlier videos today, you saw, like, they have cars. Like, they're going to have cars, and that's an example of how it could look. Like, that's some of the um, additions you can add on to it. You can put lights on it. You can make the wheels look really, really nice. Like, you can literally change each and every element to it and upgrade it. And if you buy all these upgrades to your car, you, you can have multiple cars. You could buy two of the same cars and then just spend a bunch of time upgrading it, adding money like listen just the cars alone you you could trick out a car and make a car look so nice that you burn a bunch of omi just making one car look nice 
That that's taken away from all the other NFTs. We ain't even got to include the Batmans and all this other stuff, like how you can change Batman cape and put on a whole different Batman uniform. Like just you ain't even got to bring that into it. Like just really take into consideration how the the customize the customizations that could be ha that could take place with some of these cars. And I know they're not just getting these car um because when I first heard cars when it came to NFTs, I I thought of like. I used to collect these toy cars when I was a kid. I'm like, uh, just a car sitting there. But when I saw that 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 video, especially, I, I like the upgrade, seeing how it could easily be upgraded, colors could easily be changed, and things like that. And then if you make it so you got to pay for all these things, yeah, it's, it's it's it could be insane. It could absolutely be insane. But um, <clears throat> let's move on here. Um, shout out Jesus. I think that's how you pronounce it. Shout out Jesus. Um, He's created something very, very unique and something very cool for every single investor. Every single investor needs this. Like, you need this to stay up to date and see what is going on with your money. So, check this out. Let me make sure it's um, refreshed and everything. Let's refresh it. And I'm going to link um, this to you all. I'm going to leave this link for you all. So, check this out. We have all the information that we need. And we can even see at the current rate that it's going how fast certain things is going to happen. So, this is what's estimated for us to burn five billion Omi. So um, it's estimated that at this current pace, if we keep this current pace up, 34 days is what it's going to take to um, burn five billion Omi. My prediction, we're going to burn five billion way before that. I think we'll probably do it in half the time based on when they announce the announcement that they have to announce. Because like I said, I told you all, I think we're going to break all time high with this announcement, maybe head towards two cents with just this announcement that's going to be coming out soon. So head towards two to five, like in, in between that range. I think we're definitely passing the all-time high, and then I think we could even pass two. So, um, yeah, I, I can see us heading up from there. I think this is going to be cut down because you got to think, these this, this graph, everything that we've accomplished, everything that's been happening, this is all based on the fact that things have not been released, things have been, like, being taken offline, um, we they've been doing one drop a week and sometimes they're missing weeks and stuff like and we've still been going up We've still been going up. We've still been getting burns and they've been postponing for weeks at a time It's like nothing has been really going on nothing. There, there's nothing exciting nothing going on like but now some hype is starting to build We're starting to see new visuals new demos and then we're getting closer and closer to an announcement They're, they're like tomorrow. I'm pretty sure it's tomorrow. They're gonna be at this um, little event where they're going to be revealing some things there. So that's going to be super, super exciting. Um, we'll probably check that out together. Um, I may stream that. Let me know in the comment section if you want to see me stream that. But as you can see here, at the current pace, if we wanted to burn 30, 30 billion, it would take 691 days. So obviously it would take some years to do that. But I don't think that it's going to take this long at all. Honestly, I, I wouldn't be surprised if we could cut this number in half. Even more than that. Like, even more than half. Me personally, I'm very, very bullish on this. And I feel like this this graph only takes into consideration what we have seen in the data from this point at this current point in time. I don't think we've seen a fraction of the potential that um, this project has yet. Like I said, like once they start releasing customization, like customization by itself, customization, being able to customize things, pay for upgrades, and that by itself, that feature alone could bring in so much money. With even what we just have right now, they don't release anything else. They add customizations, and then they add a few items that we could customize Batman's cape or... Um, customize like the the um powerpuff girls the colors that they're wearing put them on some like skins and stuff like that like all they have to add is customizations and um payments and stuff and you would be seeing that you would be seeing that and honestly what, what, what would be interesting is then when you um selling your nft it would be a certain nft but you could potentially sell your nft based on how your NFT looks because if you put extra upgrades into your NFT, your NFT is technically worth more money. So I can see, like right now, if you go to the um, if you go to the um, marketplace, everything is the exact same thing for a tons of different prices, and it really makes no sense. But depending on if they customize things to where you can actually make your your NFT look different and have a different feel, and you can sell these changes and sell these upgrades along with your NFT. I think that 
this would be huge. This, this would, it would actually make sense that things would be priced differently because if I put $100 worth of upgrades into my NFT, I should be able to sell it with that in mind. So if you're selling a regular one for um, $5,000, I should be able to sell mine for maybe um, six, dollars $7,000 easily. So um, that, that's just some things that we got to take into consideration too. Like customization will really boost how much people are charging. Like it, it, it will do so much as well as doing the process of customizing will um, boost things as well. So this is something that you definitely want to keep an eye on. Honestly, I think that, like I said, I think we're going to be seeing this go up way quicker than this projected here. But yeah, I mean, we have we just have to wait and see there, man. But I think I don't see us going um, back down too low from here. Honestly, I think we're getting ready. It's the calm before the storm. It's the calm before the storm. We're going. I think we're going towards all time highs, breaking all times high. I think we're 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 about getting there. So yeah, let me know what you all think in the comment section down below. Let me know if you're excited about this because I'm super pumped about this. I am ready for takeoff. Um, and yeah, like let, let's let's get it, man. So yeah, let me know y'all thoughts about this. Be sure to drop that thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you are new, and I'm gonna catch you all on the next one. Peace out.